There was a mix of first and second round matches on offer for those fans in attendance at the Rakuten Japan Open, with plenty to whet the appetites. Big things are expected of next-gen star Daniel Medvedev, and he squared off against the dangerous Alexander Dolgopolov in round one. And in the opening set, it was the Ukrainian who was calling the shots. That's good tennis. The first set wrapped up 6-1 in just 28 minutes. Dolgopolov then continued his domination in the second set. <laughs> what a <laughs> shot. <laughs> what a way to bring up match point. A tough day at the office for Medvedev as Dolgopolov cruised into round two. finish things off. Just over an hour on the clock it is Alexander Dolgopolov who goes through in straight sets. David Goffin was arguably the form player coming into the tournament, having triumphed in Shenzhen, and he faced Feliciano Lopez in another round one match. In a tight opening set, the match went with serve until the 12th game when Goffin made his move. Not just break points, but set points for David Goffin. His first break points of the match, and what a time. Coming to the ball very nicely, just at precisely the right moment. A set down, Lopez, an ATP 500 winner earlier in the year in London, was struggling to lay a racket on the Belgian silky passing shots. Ah, that's too good. Two breaks of serve followed, and Goffin's 12th ace of the match then sealed an impressive victory in the number four seed. What a way to finish with a fine flourish from David Goffin. American Ryan Harrison was seeking his first victory against Kevin Anderson as the pair met in the second round. In the first set, having broken Anderson in the sixth game, Harrison was pulling off some superlative shots to stay in front. Oh, how about that? After dropping the first set, the number five seed lifted his level and swiftly restored parity in the match. That's it. We're getting the distance. The deciding set saw neither player giving an inch in some high quality exchanges. Oh, that's gorgeous from both players. Sublime tennis. But in the third set breaker, Harrison dug deep and summoned up another stunning winner to light up the Coliseum. Oh, it's absolutely exquisite from uh, Harrison. A big win for the American as he claimed a first quarter final spot in Tokyo. There it is. Harrison seals it with another booming serve. And Ryan Harrison has pulled off another upset here in Tokyo. The last match of day three saw top seed Marin Cilic pitted against Japanese wildcard Yasutaka Uchiyama. Uchiyama more than held his own in the opening set, but in the eighth game, Cilic's power from the back of the court proved too, too much. Gah! The big hit to finish off the point. One break of serve was enough for Cilic to take the opener. And in the second set, the Croatian continued his assault on his opponent's serve. The world number five, all business, as he secured the straight set's win. There it is, what a way to finish it off. A fist pump from the top seed and a good afternoon's work from Marin Cilic. After a day's action, which witnessed surprise victories and some steadier progress for the seeds, the Japan Open continues to deliver some gripping contests.